Hi, good morning. Um, happy Easter. Happy Easter weekend to all of you. Um, <coughs> sorry, I have some allergies. All of our uh, fruit trees and flowers and stuff are blooming right now, and so I have some allergies on this Easter weekend. But um, I crocheted a really small... Hi, it's Peggy. <laughs> I crocheted a really small wig cap. And this is for a doll that's probably about nine inches tall. And I used, this is not dolly mohair, but this is a really um, like inexpensive mohair that I got. And I used a size F crochet hook and I crocheted this cap. And it took me about three hours. And so as I crocheted, I pulled all these fibers out away from the core, which is, uh, let's see, we did this before in a previous video. See this little section right here? This is the core. And little by little I pulled all these fibers away as much as I could. Now I know that this is really time consuming. This is really kind of a pain. And so what I do is after I get the cap all done, I sew it onto the doll, <clears throat> onto the doll's head, and then I trim this tail. This is my starting, starting thread. I trim this off next to the cap. I'm not going to trim that off right now, mostly because I left my scissors in the other room. But um, I wanted to show you my trick for brushing out the rest of these fibers. This is what I use. It's just a regular hairbrush. I know I've seen some people say that they use like a dog brush to brush it out, but I tried that and I ordered a special brush that had wire bristles on it and it breaks off the fibers and it d just doesn't work very good. So I started, I tried fine tooth combs, I tried a regular comb, I tried the Afro pick combs. I tried everything I could get my hands on. This is what I have come up with. This is the hairbrush that I bought. Each bristle has this little ball on the end of it. And these little balls protect the core of the yarn. And so what I do is I just use the very tip, like the very corner right here. Let's see if I can do this through this camera screen. <clears throat> and I just barely brush it just like this and you can feel it pulling against these fibers as you're brushing but it pulls out all these little fibers that are on the core still I'm not I'm not pushing down at all I'm just brushing sideways really really lightly and it really helps to pull these little fibers out. The rest of the fibers that I missed while I was crocheting, it really helps to pull those out. And it takes quite a while because you want to do the entire cap. So it takes quite a while. And you want to go different directions because these little fibers lay in different directions. So you want to go little by little all over the cap. <clears throat> and this is a really good thing to do after you get your doll done, too, after the doll is played with for some time. Because this um, mohair will get all mat matted down and twisted together and look really, really ratty looking. Because it will get all matted. And then you can use these ha this hairbrush and brush that loose. Brush it loose again so it's nice and fluffy. And it will keep it soft. It will keep it nice. So that's what I do. You just take your time, go slow, don't be ag abrasive or aggressive with it at all. Just kind of coax those little fibers out, easy peasy, just like that, all over the cap. Brush it out, 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 brush it out. There you go. See? And it doesn't bring out 
there might be a few little hairs come out but it doesn't break it off like um, a dog brush or a comb something like that and when you can't feel you can tell when it's done because as you're brushing you'll be able to feel these little fibers against these little balls you won't be able to feel it a tugging on your hairbrush anymore that'll mean that it's all done and there isn't any more to be pulled out away from the core that's how you do it so it is really possible to crochet the cap and then brush it all out I don't do it that way but it is possible to do that way it takes more time to brush it out than it does to actually pull the fibers away and crochet it so okay just take your time be gentle you can do it happy holiday thanks for coming by have a great day bye bye